Hello friends, today we are going to discuss the Von Beer's laws or the principles. Karl Ernst Von Beer is credited with the discovery of notochord and the mammalian egg. He studied the chick embryo in detail and compared the chick embryo with embryos of other vertebrates to formulate four generalizations called as Von Beer's principles or the laws. These laws state that the general features of the larger group appear earlier in development than the spatial features of the smaller group. For example, since mammals belong to phylum chordata, chordate features like pharyngeal slits, notochord, post and tail appear before the appearance of features inclusive to mammals like presence of hairs, mammary glands, etc. More general characters give rise to less general characters and special characters appear later in development. For example, skin of all vertebrates is essentially same during initial development, but as development progresses, special features like hairs in mammals, epidermal scales in fish, feathers in birds appear. The embryo of a given species instead of following adult features of the lower animals, departs from them. For example, visceral cleft of mammals form eustachian tube instead of resembling the gill slits of the adult fish. And the last principle is an embryo of higher animal resembles the embryo of lower animal, not the lower animal itself. For example, human embryo resembles the embryos of lower animals that is fish, amphibians, reptiles and birds during initial stages of development but never be same like adult fish. Thank you.